This week, Brighton and Hope Albion's Alexis McAllister received a hero's welcome on his return to the club, having won the most prestigious trophy in world football with Argentina. I didn't expect it, to be honest. Uh, but yeah, it was, it was really nice and I'm really grateful with, uh, with all the people that I was there. It was a long journey, it wasn't easy for me. Um, but at the end, um, we won the World Cup, and that's that's amazing. It is what what every player wants to to win. So yeah, really happy to 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 win it uh, at the age of 23. Following victory in Qatar, Argentina's squad returned to Buenos Aires, where they were greeted by millions of fans. After 36 years, the famous trophy was theirs again. The people uh, in Argentina was was crazy and really happy, um, and we 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 enjoyed a lot uh, with them. It was mad because there was five million people in the street celebrating, and we couldn't get to the place that we wanted. Um, but it was a really nice day with them, and I think in that moment we realized what we did. But yeah, I had a moment where I felt that. It was amazing what I was living and yeah, I got emotional and, and cried a little bit because uh, it was such a special moment for me. McAllister's performances at the World Cup drew admiration far and wide, but Brighton's number 10 remains happy on the South Coast and has pledged his future to the Seagulls. I try not to read uh, too much. I'm, I always say I'm really happy here. Uh, I don't have any rush to, to leave. Uh, I feel really good. I'm really grateful with, with this club, with my teammates and uh, all the people who work here. Uh, so I just, I'm just focused on, on the next game and, and in this club. That next match sees Brighton travel to Middlesbrough for their FA Cup third round tie. But will their midfield star be playing? To be fair, I didn't rest uh, too much in Argentina. Um, the people were ringing the, the bell of my house at 8 a.m. every day. Uh, but I feel good, I feel good. Um, I love to, to, to be on the pitch, I want to play. So we will see uh, what Roberto decides. It was a good uh, workout for for this club, I mean, for the, for the players who who went to the World Cup, um, and we know that we we've got a very good team, uh, really good players, an important game for for us, um, and we will try to win.